coming here, I'm very inspired. And if you are inspired, please give God a clap offering. I'm inspired by the story of Apostle General. And by my own story, I know that God can bless you, not because of where you're from, but in spite of where you're from. And God can turn everybody's life around if you keep the faith. Today, we're celebrating 60 years, and not just 60 years for 60 years' sake, but 60 years of a life well lived. 60 years of being a blessing unto this nation. 50 year, 60 years of being a blessing unto generations. Some of us grew up admiring you and we still admire you and hold you in high esteem. We pray that the blessing continues and your legacy continues forever and ever. The story of this country, the development of this country cannot be written without the name of Apostle General Sam Kwanshi Ankara. So I'm honored to be part of these celebrations and I'm honored to be here to join you all. We pray that what God gave you manifests in more ways than it already has. We thank God that you heeded his call, that you didn't follow your selfish needs, that you chose to serve your people as we all strive to serve our people. Where I come from, there's a saying that when God gives you, he gives so that you give unto others. So thank you for being a blessing unto everyone. I think it will be remiss of me to end my speech without acknowledging the first lady of this church. God bless you, Mama Rita. God bless you. I think sometimes as spouses, people underestimate the role that we play. And I don't speak for myself, but I know that Mama Rita has been a pillar to Reverend. And thank you for being there for him, for being there for the church, for guiding him, for praying for him. And watching the documentary, I can see that your love has propelled him in keeping your family and keeping the church. God continue to bless you.